Hello, 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 good people. Hello, good people. I am Dr. Holly Kelly, and this is Dr. Kelly's perspective for Thanksgiving Day 2018. Okay, I just wanted to spend a couple of moments with you. Hello, Cindy. Hello, Mary. Two of my faves. I just want to spend a couple of moments with you to say happy, happy, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Um, if you're out on the East Coast, it's already well into the afternoon, so you may be enjoying family and friends. So I'm even more grateful that you stop to spend a few moments with me. I just want to uh, just share with you that because, it, because particularly these are called Dr. Kelly's perspectives, gratitude is all about perspective. As we as a nation stop and slow down and celebrate this day for recognizing that all that we're grateful for, all that we're so thankful for, for the family, for the friends, for the hard times, because being grateful is about perspective. It is about how you choose to see something. Do you choose to see things that are happening to you? Or do you see things, that same incident, as something that is happening for you so that things can come through you? And it's not a play on words. Hey, Deborah, happy Thanksgiving to you too. It's not a play on words, how we perceive things that are happening to us as something that is happening to us because then we can take the role of victim very easily. Or if we take that incident, and I'm not just talking about the wonderful times in life, the promotions, the money, the health, the happiness, the laughter, the love, those are wonderful things. And they are absolutely a part of our lives. But if we're only thankful and only grateful in those times, we've missed the mark. We've missed the growth opportunity because when we can be thankful, when we can be grateful through hard times, through difficult times, through sad, heartbreaking, gut-wrenching times. Again, I don't live in Disneyland. I, nobody listening to me or no one that you listen to, no one that you know has a perfect life. They just don't. Every day is a gift. I agree. Hey, Wanda and my cousin Donnie. So when we, when we are going down a place of downhill, when we are in a place where we know, we see, you know, I don't even know what's going on with me. I just feel bad. I feel sad. I'm depressed about something. When we are in that spot, I think it is vitally important that we put the brakes on and do a gratitude check and find something. I mean, be like a secret sleuth. Be on a mission to find something to be grateful for. If you don't have an oxygen tank attached to your body, that's something to be grateful for. I don't care what may be falling apart, what may be crumbling, what may be falling down, the things that you cannot control. You want to help, you, you know you can help, you need to help, you, you're not in a position. Things are happening and you can't slow them down, you can't stop them, you can't bargain them away, you can't trade places. Will you still find something to be grateful for? Even if it's a memory. And so on this day, as many of us are gathering with family and friends and loved ones and planning on lots of laughter and food and fun and fellowship. Even while that's going on, recognize that others are struggling. They're struggling. Um, and be grateful. Be thankful. Everything changes when you are grateful. I've been reading more studies lately on the power of gratitude. It even has physiological benefits. This. Literally, you begin to heal yourself when you live in a place of gratitude. There's science behind it. 
there's neurology behind it. And so I just, hey, Mel, hey, Elliot, thank you for all who are joining me. I'm not going to stay before you um, much longer. I just want to say that I'm grateful for any time that we're able to spend together on social media, uh, electronically. I'm grateful for you. I am so, so thankful to God Almighty that he has allowed our paths to cross. Um, and I wish you nothing but a phenomenally blessed, wonderful day. It is our choice. It is our choice. Even if you've got to dig hard and dig deep for something to be grateful for, it'll be well worth the dig. Happy, happy Thanksgiving, and I'll see you tomorrow. Until next time, take real good care of yourselves.